Hello, my name is Chilla Fayesh and I am an assistant professor teaching marketing, public relations and logistics at the University of Dunoi Varos. In the next couple of minutes, I am going to introduce our engineering management bachelor's program to you. According to my degrees, I am a marketing specialist, but based on my field experience and expertise as a company consultant who is optimizing other uh, company processes and logistics processes of organizations, I can say I am an economist with an engineering mindset, or at least I try to be. Why I found this important to share with you is because building a bridge between engineering processes and management strategies have always been a challenge to companies. Therefore, organizations are committed to hiring experts who can integrate technical expertise and management skills with effective interpersonal communications. Combining and harmonizing hard technical skills with soft skills and emotional intelligence is not only an option anymore, it is a must. It is something that we have to demonstrate to stay competitive in the ever-changing markets. Therefore, successful engineering managers understand that taking an integrated and systematic view of management supports reaching operational activities, supports meeting deliverables and supports achieving organizational goals. In the frame of the program, the University of Dunoi Varos aims to provide a study program that is comprehensive, up to date and is able to provide competitive knowledge to the students who chose our university. Our engineering management program consists of seven semesters. During the first four semesters of their studies, our students are provided with strong foundations in both engineering and management in fields like physics, mechanics and mathematics, as well as in management sciences uh, like business economics and marketing. From their fifth semester, students are taking subjects related to their specialization that is focusing on logistics with subjects like supply chain management, enterprise logistics, planning of manufacturing processes and enterprise resource planning. The reason why we offer logistics specialization is that positions in logistics management, also in manufacturing management and facility management, are highly demanded and highly sought by companies. Therefore, finding a job for our top graduates across Europe is hardly a problem. But what exactly are the tasks of an engineering manager? In short, they are, their job is planning, scheduling and distributing processes, resources and information. From procurement to manufacturing, from sales to warehousing, they are the ones who manage and control key operations, define performance indicators and optimize processes. Um, there is no one single reason why a degree in engineering management is the best career path you can take. So I am going and try to focus on the main ones. First of all, you will be part of a dynamic field. Technology always changes, always evolves, and you will have to keep up with it all, always learning how to bring about innovation. Secondly, there is no such thing as a bad idea in engineering management, and this is something I always emphasize to my students. In your bachelor's studi studies, you will uh, always be encouraged to come with new solutions and come with different angles and approaches. Studying engineering management is also flexible. You can pursue a more technical or a more management-oriented path, customizing your approach based on your interest. Look around you and you will see that the work of engineering managers is everywhere. Your cup, your laptop, your scarf, everything needs someone that plan their production, their distribution and their recycling. Maintaining close relations between the university and the industry is of key importance to us as we believe that we can only provide up-to-date and competitive knowledge if we are keeping the pace with the newest trends and also with the newest technologies. Therefore, two subjects at our university are never the same as we are integrating new and relevant examples and case studies into the curriculum semester by semester. Providing hands-on knowledge and also an engaging, motivational, yet fun learning experience requires a lot from us, from the lecturers as well. So me and my colleagues are always focusing on keeping small class sizes, therefore providing the opportunity to pay special attention to each and every one of our students, their academic and personal progress, and also to reaching our academic goals and your individual goals. Here in Dunoi Varos, you are not going to be one in a thousand, but you are going to be the one. And we look forward to learn with you, we look forward to learn from you, and we look forward to learn about you. So see you soon.